Okay, so you, you, you might already have a theme and you, this might not be that important to you, but these sort of things are important to know. So when purchasing a theme, the number one thing you want to look for is when the, the item was released, okay, how popular it is. This is just, this is on uh, Theme Forest. The information that's included within the theme and the change log. This is where you'll see how many times this has been updated. And that basically tell you, tells you whether it's been, whether it is well supported. Okay, and that means basically there's every single thing that gets released, there's problems with it. Okay, and there's things that don't work as they should. Because a person who designs a theme might only have one or themselves or one or two other people testing it. When they release it and sell it, they might get hundreds, if not thousands of people testing it saying, oh, there's bugs here. And you'll see that there's all these different bug fixes within, within the, the theme. Okay, and so you're always having to upgrade the theme uh, that you purchase um, to the latest version. Um, obviously for new features and for bug fixes. And that's why, again, it's so important that your theme is a child theme. Uh, especially if you've done, if you do name modifications, you don't need a child theme. But if you want to modify the site to perform different things or lay out a little bit different, then you're going to have to, 100% guaranteed have to have a child theme. Or you're going to have a nightmare going forward. Okay, so let's recap. When choosing a theme, um, the most important thing is that the theme is, uh, the theme is popular and it's well supported. If it's not popular, it won't get support because the person will move on and design something else that might be more popular. So you want to make sure that the theme is reasonably popular. You know, 501 purchases at $55 is $25,000. It's probably been out for about a year. That's not bad for one theme for one developer. He'll get a percentage cut off of that by Theme Forest, but it's, you know, he's, he's making some good money out of it, so he's going to support it quite well. Okay, so just remember that. Always make sure the theme is well supported and updated on a regular basis.